Hi friend, my name is Turi. In this video, I want to talk about how to create an online webinar using pre-recorded videos. A webinar is actually a seminar or a conference you host on the internet for people all over the world that can watch it. Now, previously, for you to create this webinar, you need what we call a webinar host that is very expensive. Now, if you want to host a webinar that will have like 100 students, you might be spending over $100 and above and all that. Then secondly, again, if you lived in third world country where internet is not that fast or that is very bad, your videos will be buffering, then students will not hear you clearly, you won't be audible, the video qualities will also drop most especially in Nigeria and in Ghana. So if you are watching this video and you are in those countries and probably even if you are in the Western world in America and UK, you can also use pre-recorded videos because you can record your trainings, you can record your webinars, you can record your conferences at home in video format, you can edit it, then you can now stream it live for students to watch. So you can watch the entire series on how we create this online webinar in our online school called to reschool.com slash webinar i'm going to paste the url in this video but now let's get into our pc and see practical demonstrations on how to create this online webinar using pre-recorded videos so in this class we want to learn how to configure the online webinar script and to use it to create our online webinars now before we we'll go into configurating it and creating our webinar class and all that. So the first thing we'll do, let's check how the, this is called the landing page. So this is what the users or the students, they will see. So for instance, now I did this one for mini importation business. So I titled it as introduction to exclusive, whatever, then a little bit right up at the right part. Then here yeah, you now put an introductory videos too, maybe like a one minute video where you will sell the class or the webinar and all that you talk about what the students will gain which happens to be all this so this is what they would gain for attending the class then this right part is where the students can now register for the webinar and all that so this is where the students can now register and all that so for instance now let me just try it and put my name here let's say to re let me use info at um, Paul Jumbo dot com and I'll click on register. So, so once I register now, it will take me to the thank you page to see how it looks like. So you can see now, congratulations, you are signed up for the webinar. So this is the thank you page. In this page now, you can now put a short video here. Also, you upload it to YouTube and um, also tell um, your students what they will gain and also tell them to bookmark the class too so that on google calendar so that they can get a reminder or outlook out iCal so that they can get a reminder for the class and all that then it will also give them a link that they can bookmark and save so this very link is the link that will give them access to the live class on the day of the training which happens to be Wednesday on the 20th, okay? So, but now if we click on this link now, let me copy this link and we'll keep, click on this link because the class has not comment. It will show us um, what we call the timer class where it will now tell the student, okay, you are viewing this webinar that is not live because the webinar is not live yet. And um, it will tell them that the class will start in two days time, in three hours and all that. So anytime they click on that link, it will take them here until when the class commences. So when the class commence now, it will now take them to, I think I've opened it. When the class comment, it commence, it will now take them. So this is the live class here. This is the live training too. So where they can now turn up their speaker and listen to the class all they need to do is to click on play now we'll make this video auto play so that immediately they get they'll start watching the training and all that so you can now embed your youtube you can embed wistia you can also do live facebook videos too and put it here too depending as you want it so this is now the live webinar class why this is the thank you page when they register for a class so there are details has been taken and all that okay then while this part 
is actually the the okay this is like the timer page then while the other classes okay i've closed it it's like the thank you page that i've said before where they will go and um, register okay so how do we click create this webinar site or this webinar page here all we need to do we'll go to our software so if you look at here now you see mini importation training so this is the one that i did that we just watched so i've done this one before so if you look at it lp landing page about 94 people have watched this one i just did it pri privately then the webinar view and all that so if you want to create a new webinar now just click here on create new live webinar okay so i've clicked on create new live webinar now so now it will ask us now to put our webinar title what we want to do so i can say maybe personal branding personal branding master class okay so that's the title of our seminar so i can say um we are going to learn learn how to create personal how to create personal brand or something how to create personal brand using using instagram okay so we'll see all this by the time i'm done so yeah now now put who is a facilitator so let me put myself which is to read so this is where you now put your name to Madagua. So when is the date? The date starts when? So I can say maybe it starts on the 20th of February 2019. And what is the time? I can say 20.00, which is like 8 o'clock in um, Nigerian time. So you now put our time zone here. So I'll just scroll down here and put UTC plus 1, which is Central African time. So if you are in US, you just look at your time zone. So I'll click here and create webinar. Okay, so our webinar would have been created now. So, so the webinar has now been created. So you can see it's here now. So this is everything we need to do here. So here now we have our landing page where we have the thank you page. Here we have the live page. So these are the places we we'll just configure. So under the landing page, I'll just come here. So here. Yeah, it's where I will now like put our landing details. I can edit the style how I want it. So we can play around it, but I don't want this class to be too long. At our other classes, we'll explain this. So let me just talk about the copy. So I can now click here now and say show video. So this is where I use mine. So here now you can now put your YouTube video here where you now talk about the class encourage people to register in the class what they stand to gain the benefits so you can do like one minute videos and paste it here so what you do is that you just go to you upload the video to youtube and then um, you just copy it so for instance now let me open my videos now on youtube so if i want to use any of this video now as my introduction let's say i want to use this how to use pre-recorded videos i'll just click here on share yeah and i'll click on embed so i'll just copy this embed code okay so what i'll do here now is i'll just go to our class now and paste this embed code okay so it's going to resize it by itself so don't worry so whatever you do so i'll just click and embed the code that i've copied on youtube i'll just copy it here and paste it here it's going to resize it by itself so whatever you do you just go down and click on save changes so let me scroll up so here now we have our main headline this is where you now put your headline okay let me click here now so i'll click here on our headline so you can see introducing this exclusive webinar from turi i can say turi so you can put your organization or yourself i can say turi online school okay so this will be in the title so I can say introducing this exclusive webinar from Turi Online School on, on how to create personal, how to create a personal branding, how to create a personal brand using Instagram, okay? And all that. So what I'll do is I'll also click here and click on save changes. 
Now, as you are doing it, it's better you are previewing it. So I'll just click here, view landing page. So it will show me how what we are doing so far. So if you look at it now, so this is the video introducing the exclusive webinar from Turi Online School on how to create a personal branding class using Instagram and all that. Okay. So we've seen it here now. So this is how it's going to be. So here we now have the video that I talked about that will talk about everything you you have to learn if you're attending the online webinar and all that. Why this right part is where you register for the class. So I can decide to make this just simple like this without putting any text. But I can decide to also still put text in it. Okay. So here now we we'll now put we now scroll here, go back now. So we've put the video. So yeah, this is where we'll now put the main thing, what, where the student, what they will learn. So I can say what you will learn. You can change all this. You can write whatever. I can say what you stand to learn or delete it or whatever. So yeah, and I can say what the student will want to learn. Let's say introduction to Instagram. To Instagram. Then maybe the next thing they will learn is how to get followers from instagram like that everything that they'll learn so i can just put them in bullet point like this then i can put this in bullet point like this then i'll just go up and scroll okay save and update okay so we, so we get it so now let's go to our page also and refresh the landing page so this is how it is now. So you can see it comes with bullet points and all that. So I can decide to now put some text here at the top of here. How do we do that? We'll now go to here. So let me close here. Let me close here. So here now, we'll now see opt-in headline. So which is this. So this will now be at the right part. So I can say um, this, maybe this is the best. This is the best online webinar you need to attend on how to grow how to grow your brand how to grow your brand using instagram or something like that okay so i'll just click here now i'll also go down and click on save changes and um, I can decide to connect to, I can put our webinar dates. Okay, I, I've clicked on save changes. Let's see how, how it is in our web page too, in our class here. So you can see it's now, so it's already on the right. I can say this is the best online webinar you need to attend on how to grow your personal brand. Then yell also, so you can now put your copy, write more or write less. So depending on you. So here now I can put the date here. So I can say the date will now be February 20th, Wednesday, whatever. So you can change all this and put your date of your webinar and um, all that. So this is the form that they will fill at the right part. Okay. So here now I can decide to say email field. So this is where they will put their email. So I can decide to use full name. I will leave out this. So I can decide to hide phone number. So I can click here now and say, okay, no, I want their phone numbers to show. So they can enter their phone number when registering for the online class. Okay. But if you are targeting a lot of foreigners, they are not comfortable using phone numbers. They're just good for email and um, email and all that. So yeah, I can say like for Nigeria and I can say, enter enter your whatsapp numbers okay okay so i can say here that so here yeah, now if you want to add skype if you want to do work on this and do any other thing so i can say register for the webinar whatever whatever and i'll click on save and update okay so the last thing I'll talk about is the autoresponder integration. So you can put your autoresponder code here from um, Aweber, getresponse.com, and any of this website so that you can capture their email into your database and you can now be sending what we call opt-in emails. Okay, and all that. So let me click on save changes. Okay, the last one I'll talk about is Facebook. 
I can actually do Facebook connect. So here, I'll just go to Facebook now and connect it using the app and all that. We'll talk about this at the previous class, at the uh, next classes, okay? So I'll click here on save changes. So if you see here now, so this is our landing page. Very simple. So you can see how it is now. So phone number has been added. So I said, you enter your name, your, your best email, then here your WhatsApp number, then you register for the webinar. Okay, so we've grabbed your name, your email, and your WhatsApp number. So we can still continue adding you on WhatsApp, add you, and all that, okay? So now we've done the landing page. The next one we'll talk about is our thank you page. So this is the page they will see immediately they register in the form. So here we can now go here and click on view thank you page, So which is this. So this is how the thank you page will be. So you can put an image here just to tell them thank you for attending the class. Or you can just put a short video to, to tell them please bookmark this registration on your Google Calendar so that you get reminders and all that. So it's important you put the video here. So how do you do all that? So this one doesn't take much time. So I can click here and um, put show video here and also put embed our YouTube code here too. So the thank you page you've done. So I'll click here on save changes, okay? So let's go to the page now and I'll click here too. So you can see it now, it has updated it with a video. So this is the video that will tell them about the class, please bookmark very important to encourage your students to bookmark using google calendar so that it will remind them in the day of the training and all that so now it's going to google calendar so they can now like save it so i've saved it now so once it gets to that day it will send a reminder to each student that oh you're, you're having a class so on so and so time and all that okay so let's talk about the last part which is the live webinar so here yeah, now the same process too let me also put the code so this will now be the main training itself that you are offering so i'll just click here on uh, save i'll just click here on save and update so let me preview the live webinar class here so you've seen it's very, very simple. So this is the live webinar class. So this is where students can now put their name. They can ask questions. You can respond to them live. You can now put your direct phone number here and all that for people to call, okay, within the class and all that, okay? Then the last thing is you can also now sell. You can now say, okay, I'm giving a discount for anybody that buy my master class, my advanced class, my ebook, my software, whatever I hear. Or you can actually give a free gift and put it here. So, so that's that about it. So it's very simple. So here is also the webinar replay. So you can put the video here for people to watch after the class is over. So here is the live Q and A question and answers. You can customize it, then the settings and all that. So it's a very easy software. Thank you for taking this class.